Hey guys, it's Gabriel, and like I said, I'm going to talk about pitch for a little bit. Um, first off, just got to say that there's a ton of different pitch-related effects out there. Um, you can take the form of software. Most DAWs come with plugins nowadays um, that that are there to manipulate pitch. Uh, you could also take the form of hardware. Um, I'm going to be demonstrating a few guitar pedals that I have. That some, of the, some of the pitch effects you can do, you can have uh, pitch correction software, which is um, something somewhat like auto-tune. It originally was used to uh, make sure people were all, you know, at pitch, uh, whether or not it was an instrument that was not tuned properly or um, a singer that was just a little flat or a little sharp. Um, it was a useful studio tool and more recently has been used more as an effect uh, by twisting the parameters to the extremes um, and our little transitions um, that we used for this video were done on an iPhone app called Songify that was just like kind of an auto-tune um, type type pitch manipulation um, so there's that uh, this next example is a pitch shifting effect um, where it takes the signal and shifts that pitch Shifts your signal up an octave is the example I'm using, but there's all different types of options for it. Um, so you can hear that here. And the next one I have is harmonization. With with all the technology we have now, you can you know this is this is similar to the pitch correction in that it um, it's intelligent. It, it knows which you're going to assign a key or a scale that you're going to be playing in, um, and it will take your signal and find the right notes that you go along with that in the, in the right interval that you would also choose. Um, and instead of just cr replacing your original signal with, with this corrected note, it adds it on top of it as, as a harmony. Um, the pedal I'm using does that similarly. And this last one's a pitch modulation. This one's just a little bit more out of control. It kind of goes at its own rate, which you can assign, um, and you can kind of control the range of the pitch that it that it wavers. But um, again, with software versions of effects, you have a lot more control generally. Um, this one was just kind of a boutique pedal that goes in and out and and affects the pitch much like a, a vibrato. But instead of doing just the volume swells, it's in and out. It's uh, manipulating the pitch. All right. So like I said, I'm Gabriel Garber. Um, appreciate you guys watching. And for David and Virginia, just want to say thanks. Yeah.